why you're getting a little bit older too when you go to clubs and, and bars is when you start getting annoyed easily at things. Right? Like, uh, there's always a pack of girls running around screaming about something at a nightclub. Like, this, it's my birthday! It's her birthday! I go, really? Like, we would never would have known with a tiara on her head and a sash that says, it's my birthday. Thanks for announcing that. I love listening to conversations at bars. That's my favorite, like listening to like, women talk. Like I heard a girl recently, she goes, oh, I can't drink whiskey because it turns me into such a whore. Yeah. <laughs> really, the whiskey does that? Like you had one shot and you're blowing a dude in the parking lot. I don't think it's the whiskey, all right? Never hear a dude say that. I'm like, dude, I had like three beers and they turned me into such a whore, man. Screwing two girls in the bathroom. Oh, I can't drink beer anymore. Maybe you're never gonna hear a guy say that, but you know. <laughs> There's always a group of girls, that same group of girls that's running around screaming about, This is my song! Every time some song comes on, why is it your song? Huh? Like, it's always the same songs, too. It's like, Journeys, Don't Stop Believing. Like, no, I think you can stop believing for one night, please. Or it's Beyonce's, all the single ladies. Every time that song comes on, you guys have to go ape shit for that. That song's like four or five years old. Please, can we stop with that? Like, as a guy, I can't like that song, all right? Because of the lyrics. The lyrics of that song are, if you like it, put a ring on it. Really, Beyonce? Really? Why don't you just shut your dirty horse mouth? How about that, okay? Is she the last to know we've been in a recession? That's my question, okay? Like, for at least a few years. Maybe I can't afford a ring to put on it, all right? That's all I'm saying. Just change your lyrics. Like, maybe say something like, you know, if you like it, take it to a movie. Like, okay. <laughs> well, if you like it, buy it a drink. All right, I'm bored. That's me. You know, or if you like it, you know, make it breakfast after you nail it. All right. I'm okay with that. At least, yeah, the world's like, horrible. It's so horrible. Spoken like a money grubbing whore right there. <laughs> buy the ring, bitch. At least she's kind of classy, though. At least she has somewhat of a message, right? I heard a song by Lil Wayne, and I don't even know what the fuck he's saying in that song. He has, a, he has the lyrics in his song, and this is a song I heard. The lyrics were, pop that pussy the right way. I don't know what the fuck that means to you. Like, really? Like, I mean, it just sounds disgusting. It sounds like you're popping a zit, is what it's I picture. Like it sounds like it sounds like like you know like I mean I don't understand like I mean are, how do you know you're popping it the right way is my question right like does it make a sound like bubble wrap does confetti come shooting out like congratulations Papa Pussy it sounds it sounds like something women you see women walking funny from like oh my god I should not have let him pop that pussy last time Ooh. Ooh. Like, our ladies calling in sick the next day to work? Like, oh, my pussy got popped the wrong way. Like, oh, I gotta, I gotta get that popped back in. Looks like an airbag after it's been deflated. I gotta get that back in. It's just too much. Guys, my name is Chris Milhouse. Thank you very much.